Good evening. Tonight, both CNAs still listed as eligible on the state's health care worker registry. That's nearly nine months after that abuse that the 91 year old says she's still having nightmares about. This Snapchat video shows a 91 year old woman who suffers from dementia being taunted inside of a suburban nursing home. You can hear Margaret Mary Collins yelling out for help as two certified nursing assistants tease her with a hospital gown as she lays in her bed at the Abington Nursing Home in Glenview. In the video, you can see her arms flailing like, could my mom get out of bed and defend herself or walk away from it? No, and they knew that. Family members say those CNAs, Brian Cortez and Jamie Monteza, knew their confused mother did not like those gowns. So they recorded a reaction for their entertainment. Workers that you trusted to care for my mom, she's just a loving person, that they would come in and taunt her with the hospital gown. Today, Cortez and Monteza pled guilty to misdemeanor charges, standing before a judge who told them their behavior was unacceptable. Both walked away with the supervision and a no-contact order. I wish there was uh, more. I do feel it's an egregious act of trust. The duo was fired from the Abington Nursing Home. Family members do not want Monteza or Cortez to work in any other facilities, but a quick search on the state's health care worker registry shows that both are still listed as eligible CNAs. More than eight months later, no notes of their arrest are listed. The family hopes the state will make those changes to stop them from being able to do this again. In my opinion, this wasn't the first go around. The State Department of Health says that criminal offenses are included in the registry once there is a conviction that happened today. The department does tell us that the health care worker profile will then be updated after state police run another background check that can take anywhere from a few days to a few weeks. Family members also telling me tonight they're suing the Abington Nursing Home. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.